Hey guys, today we're going to take a look at the refined Notate port for our Galaxy S2016 which has awesome Notate features uh, which you can see on the Notate because this is a Notate port. So let's review it and let's start. Starting with the home screen, we get the normal 7.0 launcher. As into the home screen settings, uh, we don't get the swipe down to open notifications, the quick actions. And now here when you see in the drawer, now that we have some Samsung apps, also some Google apps, so it's not that you can you know, tell it, it's deep loaded. Swiping right and left, it has the live wallpaper effect. We don't have sensor hub because uh, we don't have sensor hub, so it doesn't move automatically while uh, tilting or shifting the device. So yeah, this is home screen. Just moving to the quick settings, we get the multi-user mode. We have the Wi-Fi calling, blue light filter doesn't work, S-bike mode, S-power planning, edge lighting, capture screen, also record screen too. And edge lighting works so just move into settings and enable all notifications and move to the advanced setting for having the width and you can just control the color and all the stuff here now this is a noted port and it has native blur as you can see in the app drawer into the edge panels onto the power menu and also on the launcher settings so it looks cool also do get a noted camera so let's move to the camera app as you can see the full screen camera mode here you can see full view turned off we don't get dual camera like the portrait mode live focus mode so we have single camera these are the modes and you kind of download extra things so that's very sad moving to the front camera the front camera seems okay we have the live focus here option but don't click here it just freezes so you need to just remove this and open again so that the camera works and it clicks pictures also clicks pictures on the front so no option like no bug here not on option and under the advanced features we get the s pen the caller id and spam protection s pen doesn't work because we don't have the air command app installed and we have finger screen finger screen gestures but i don't know what why this option is here because it's a noted port it's here we don't have fingerprint anywhere <laughs> and we have multi window and all of the usual stuff direct share but we don't got the video enhancer so it should have been having the display maybe a display it's not there so maybe it's not there i guess so in display also we have some normal options only LED indicator doesn't work because we don't have it screen timeout up to 30 minutes now because it was earlier only i guess 10 minutes only uh, so that's also we get infinity wallpapers of the noted so moving into the wallpapers and themes weaving all we have one two three four the infinity wallpapers all other are normal noted wallpapers so it's nice now in this rom we don't have any location bug so location is working on weather so if you have a location on for your weather you can use easily use it on and we also have VOLT. we don't need to flash any zip it's uh, still there uh, from the boot and that's it for this review if you really love this video please leave a feedback down below and if not you can do the likes and dislike stuff also subscribe if you uh, want to and bye bye I will see you guys in the next one.